So for the last 15 years or so, um, Beatty's Fusion software has been the software, the package that we've been using on all of our vision systems and profile projectors. Today we're going to talk about the latest version of, of, of Beatty Fusion, which is the V4 version, where we've got a few enhancements and um, efficiency improvements that I want to talk about. Um, so let's go over to the camera and do some camera measurement. Um, first of all, I'm just going to put this um, touch probe away. So having put the probe away, we can now look at some of the camera tools that we've got um, available for measuring features by non-contact. Um, here, you can see a list of tools that I have available to me. These are all video edge detection tools, um, ranging from the standard geometric features like circle, line, arc, point, and so on. Um, and we've got some more um, specific functions to Fusion like thread tools, uh, curve scanning, profile scanning tools, um, one click feature and um, a great tool which is a great new tool which is all features in an area. Um, so we'll come on to those later. Um, let's just talk about how we take data. Those of you who are um, used to or have had experience measuring parts using a profile projector or an optical comparator will be familiar with this. Um, you would typically in the most basic form, use the crosshair on your screen to target points. And I've got a crosshair here on my screen, um, and basically I can simply zero out the, the DRO count. We can move the object across, the image across, align that with the crosshair, and read off a distance on our DRO. Simple point-to-point -point measurement. Of course, we can still do those simple, quick, and easy measurements on the venture, but for the most part, we're going to change our measurement method from crosshair and any of these other manual um, methods to edge detection. That's the power of vision. So when we, when we take um, edge detection me measurements, I'm just going to line this part up and, so that we can start to show you the difference. So with a, using the video edge detection tools, I can simply draw a box over the edge of this line that I want to measure and I'm creating a scanning width here and with the, with the next click of a mouse I've fired the tool and you can see here that I've taken in this case 233 points in one mouse click. So the first thing that you can understand from that little exercise is vision's fast. So if, there were, if that was the end of this feature um, I would simply hit the green tick and we would we would move on to the next feature, but I can see there's more of this line outside of my current field of view. So I'm simply going to either use the joystick or the mouse to drive the stage over and fire the tool again. Because my measurement window is open, I can simply add more and more data uh, measuring bigger features using multiple camera grabs. So I've measured a line now with 430 data points I'm going to use that as a reference feature, an alignment feature, and that's the end of that. And you can see in my XY view here now, I have actually drawn the feature we've just measured. Let's bring a circle into, into view now. Same thing, I haven't changed the tool because I've got an auto select tool um, selected up there in my toolbar. And you can see that that tool just automatically went to a circle tool. Same process, I've got a, a scanning width here. And in this case, I've scanned a nominally two millimeter diameter, taking 304 data points. So what that tells me is a very accurate um, calculation of that diameter, and here it is. But it also gives me a very, very good understanding of the form of that circle, because 300 and something points around a two millimeter circle describes the shape of that circle extremely well. So it's like we've scanned it and um, vision gives you a good understanding of form error as well as the nominal geometric result. Okay, so a great tool that we have on the Venture XT is um, the ability to drive the stage using the mouse. So if I just click my mouse and grab the image and drag it across there, you can see that the stage does a corresponding move. I don't have to take my mouse, my hand from the mouse onto the joystick to do that. 
and that's a really convenient way of driving the machine around the part that you want to measure. So again, using the auto select tool, I'm simply drawing boxes and you'll notice this time I'm speeding things up using the, the, the mouse drag tool. I'm not even having to complete each of these measurements. I'm just simply drawing boxes. The software is making great decisions about giving me the right kind of tool for each feature. So for simple parts like this, setting the inspection routine up is incredibly easy. If you can use a mouse, you can use Venture. So having created some measurements using our video edge detection tools, um, you can see here on the left hand monitor, I've got um, a graphic representation of the part we've just measured. So clearly we've measured something, but where are the results? Well, the way that Fusion works is to just simply allow you to select the features you're interested in and start to populate this view with dimensions, just like that. So if I want the angle between these two lines, I'll simply select those two lines and the software intuitively gives me the right dimension type according to the selection I've made. Now, a lot of people like this style of reporting. As engineers, we're all used to reading engineering drawings. So basically, I'm arranging this view just like the drawing, the manufacturing drawing that I'm using to control this part. So another example would be if we selected, say, this radius and this radius, the software's previewing the type, dimension type it's going to give me. And if that's the way the drawing um, calls that out, then that's fine. I'll just decide where to position that dimension. But if it's not, then simply right clicking at this point allows me to change the dimension type to the type that um, replicates the way it's called out on the drawing. So setting up your um, your, your results in a, in a familiar way is incredibly easy.